Good. Yep. All right, guys. Hey, uh, so a lot of you have asked me on the Sling Studio video uh, that I made about how we get the lyrics to go to here, which is the, you can show them this one, Bruce. This is the computer where we do our live feed. This is Sling Studio. That's the, there's the box and all of it goes here when we go live. This is the computer that does the lyrics. This is what runs our, our pro presenter. All right, so all you have to do is you take the camera link right here, you plug it into an outlet, you, you turn it on, and then it's got a USB that goes to this computer. <clears throat> and basically all you're doing is you're turning this computer into a camera. Normally this would hook to a camera and it would send signal from your camera to your Sling Studio box. <clears throat> but instead we're using it to send signal from this computer to the Sling Studio box. And all you do is when you hook it up, you go into, you go up here, let's see, you go to your display and I don't, um, let's see, let's just go here. Let's go to system preferences. You go to system preferences and you're going to go to, where's it at? Where's it at? Where's it at? <clears throat> Displays right here. All right, you, you see your display set. Now, if the, you don't have, if you're not using Mac or whatever, um, I don't, th I just know how to do it on Mac right now. So anyway, you go to your displays. When you do, if you'll go, you go to your displays and you hit arrangement. When you hit arrangement, you're gonna see this computer. If you click on it, it's this computer. Then you click on it, there's one, and that would be, um, the main screen out there and this one is the stage display you can show them up there bruce see that one turn red that's our stage display which we got a screen in here to see it all right <clears throat> but this one right here is the camera link that's the camera link that we have on when you turn that camera link on it's going to show up as a display and if i click it show them over here uh well it's not showing up red but Right there it is. See there, that's the camera link. That's an external display that it's going to that. So once you do that and you set this up as an external display <clears throat> and it automatically will show up. You go, you, once you do that, you go to pro presenter. Okay. You pull up pro presenter. Take it a second here to pull up. All right. I've got pro presenter up. This is pro presenter seven. And all I did was, <clears throat> I got themes here. You create a theme, um, and I've created one. If you can see that, if you can read that, it says chroma key, all right? And I made chroma key. And all I did, just to show you guys, go to edit here. All right, I created a green screen, a green screen with a, with a black text box. And just make it green. I mean, you can go up here and select it and make it green or whatever. So I done that with a black text box. And I just made that just for for um, for chroma key. All right. And then once you do that, you go up here to the top and you go to screens. And you can go down to configure screens. And here's your screens. You got audience, chroma key, and announcements. And then you got your stage screen. This is the chroma screen. So you make sure that that's set to the right screen. Um, and it's set to this output. If you see that, you can see it's the little output that, see, you can select whichever one you want it to go to. That's the output for the camera link. You select that one, that's the chroma, you select it. All right, once you do that, then, then you've selected that theme for that screen. And then it sends it over here. So like if I click on this song right here and the lyrics and stuff pop up, over here, he's got this set up, and you can see it right there. It, it, because this has gone away, you got to go here to Chroma Settings, and you, of course, when you do, you select the green on the screen there. Because if I take that off, you, you select this, whatever color you want to be Chroma, you select it. So you just select that, you drop it on this, and it selects that. Then you can put Uses Chroma, and it takes it away. And right here, you can select the sensitivity and stuff around this box, but you just save it. Once you save it, which it's already saved there, we drop, take the lyrics, 
drop them up here and what's green has disappeared and your lyrics are overlaid and that's it and then you can just when you drop this over here preview to program it's going to have the lyrics up there so that's pretty much it that's how you do it that's how you set up your chroma your chroma key uh for that goes from your pro presenter to an external display to that to that and it's pretty simple so like i said when you go to your screens up here you you go to edit looks you can go to you, you configure it to that screen and you go to edit looks and right down here there's there's this here's your chroma okay you can send your media to it like if i play a video over here for the people in the sanctuary i can actually send that video by clicking media to this computer but you, you click the theme here you click chroma key and you select the chroma key theme that you want that screen sent to there over here so that's pretty much it if you have any more questions um about how to do this just let me know and uh these guys Bo and Bruce you know they run this stuff I just kind of help them set it up and anyways if y'all have any questions just let me know and uh I'll do my best to answer I'm no pro but I figured out how to do this so I'm trying to help you guys do the same see ya